My name is Len Clark. I live in Portage, Indiana. There is currently a severe sun, uh, storm watch in northwest Indiana. It is currently 1.20 in the afternoon central time and you can see it is very dark. It feels like nighttime. Uh, winds coming strong now out of the west, kind of swirling. Looks like it's coming out of the southwest as well as I am going to drive downtown Portage when I get the opportunity to just kind of look at the weather conditions. Uh, they're expecting winds up to 60 miles per hour. Hail is anticipated. No rain as of yet. I have seen one uh, little bit of lightning. So this is just the, the front edge of the storm that is coming into Northwest Indiana. It's been very hot today. Temperatures in the upper 90. Starting to cool down now 82 degrees. And so that uh, high pressure, low pressure with a uh, drop in temperature could produce some um, uh, very intense weather. As you can see, the street lights are on, at least one of them. They alternate here in Portage. Wind picking up. You can see some light off into the distance. Uh, the storm clouds heading toward the east. And uh, a lot of traffic this afternoon. Individuals are going about their daily activities, trying to get home prior to the storm. Uh, yesterday, two days ago, in the state of Indiana, there were some severe thunderstorm warnings. Uh, thunderstorms in effect uh, trees downing power lines and so individuals anticipating for that as well as you can see the swirling winds really picking up so I'll pop on the weather radio we'll listen to a little bit as we drive down Central Avenue in Portage Indiana taking a look at the weather conditions and how the city is reacting So 47 minutes left in the severe thunderstorm warning. We are heading into downtown Portage right now. If I take a look off to my left, the north, that is looking toward Lake Michigan. We're approximately four miles from Lake Michigan. There is some weather uh, maritime warnings out there as well. So hopefully the boaters were able to get off of the lake. Uh, traffic here in uh, downtown Portage, kind of intense for the afternoon. A lot of traffic individuals coming off of the interstate possibly to take cover from the storm. As we just look and scan the horizon, as you can see those clouds moving in from the northwest heading toward the downtown area. To my right, the south, there is also some dark clouds. Straight ahead toward Chesterton, Indiana, there is still some light as the storm is creeping its way that way. Currently 124, very dark in the afternoon on this Sunday afternoon, July 1st. So I'm using the pivot head sunglasses as a reporting tool this afternoon. And you can really see those clouds moving. According to weather radio, Winds 60 to 80 miles per hour. Gusts of 80 miles per hour recorded in Griffith, approximately 15 miles to the west of Portage. As we turn left and head up Willow Creek Avenue, we are looking north. And so I'm going to cut through some of the back roads and head back home. Some traffic coming toward me. 
uh, the Indiana Toll Road as well as uh, US 94. Individuals may be coming off of that to get off of the highways anticipating the storm. See the trees reacting to the winds as it is starting to pick up. Heading on to Evergreen Avenue as we will be heading west. to the northwest. You can see the sky starting to brighten up a little bit. Some of the darker clouds going by, heading toward the east. The weather warning in effect until 2.20 central time, currently 1.26 central time here in Portage, Indiana. Looks like the winds have diminished here. Hopefully the weather averting this area. But a couple of days ago, some strong weather, winds knocking down trees and power lines. We do need the rain, but uh, not a lot at one time. A lot of rain could just cause some uh, mudding and flooding and da actually damaging the local produce crops even more so that has been caused by the heat and the drought if you will we're going to turn left here this is Swanson Road I'll be heading back to Central Avenue and heading right and heading home to make sure I can batten down the house and making sure that cars will be put out of range of trees and to put into the garage to anticipate any hail. According to that flag, it is coming out of the west now. Once again, heading west. Just a couple of blocks from home as we are on Central Avenue. We'll veer off to the right here once again have not seen much lightning but anticipating that as the storm gets closer First precipitation we have seen starting to fall at 129. So the storm is actually making its way into Portage now, releasing rains. Winds not as bad as they were earlier. As I will pull and try to get the car in the garage to avoid any damage caused by any potential hail. You hear thunder in the background right now as the storm is approaching. Clear space. 
this out here. Forgot to roll up his windows. Okay. Go ahead and try 